Okay, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, we are checking out the Neo Muna Pulse Rifle. I actually got three rolls of this. All three of them happen to have Head Seeker, but I figured this would be the best one. So this is the Philotactic Spiral. Honestly, drop a like for that attempt because I think I kind of, I think I might have nailed it. I thought this was going to go really wrong. But the role we have today is small bore, armor piercing, or light mag. We're going to go with armor piercing, tunnel vision, and head seeker. Those of you that don't know, head seeker got a nice buff last season. It's actually a really solid perk now. Uh, and then we still have the nanotech tracer rockets, just like the hand cannon. If you didn't see that video, it'll be linked to the top right now. This thing also has a range master work. We're going to be running a counterbalance stock to bring the 80 recoil direction up to a nice clean 95. We're going to pair this with a fracta fist, a fitting aspects, and uh, without further ado, let's get into it. Dead cliffs, and we are back on strand. Taking away my resilience. Your team and your it's time to Fight. pop off. He's got one shot. We're gonna try and peek around that nade. Check him. We're trying to trade it. I have threat of a scent right now. I just don't know what that does, but I have some sort of buff. Oh wait, a lot of people spawning here. More than I thought. Got one. We have decent flank, but they know about it for sure. Too dead. No shotgun ammo, so we don't really want to be playing this close. There we go. Nice. Some big team shots. Putting behind us now. What? There we go, 10 streak. That guy's weak. Oh, gonna be a lot coming right side, looks like. Lots of angles on us. Nice. I just got a three piece without doing anything. Dude, this thing is a fucking laser beam. Oh, I didn't get my melee off. Damn. It's been so close that we ran as well. Feels bad. You know, I've made two videos on Wallet now. So far, I'm not getting too much done with this super. This guy's weak, but instead we'll know he's going to back off and repeat. There we go. Holy shit. What the Spider-Man? Is he damage resistant there? I think I think he was. Oh, I must choke that. Bad shots for me. We got a kill. I think we're getting a lot of kills this game. Holy shit, there's a guy close to me. I had no idea he was there. Holy shit, I think we're all dead. No, I nearly killed it. All right, nice. Team Megala finish. I killed the close guy. See this pulse rifle. And we get a better super before the game ends. Really weak here in the corner. Pick a trade. I probably should have played the door and see if I could get more than one, but game is about to end. 
Trade's a safe bet there. Nice. Got the dub. I feel like that was a good high kill game. There's also dead clips and sixes, which I very rarely get to play. Dude, this pulse is feeling good. Can't lie. But we ended up dropping a nice 44, 19 streak, bro. We dropped 44 defeats, 6.29 efficiency. Really nice game there. The playmaker. Okay, so we got Endless Veil. I'm also going to change the nade here. I want to try the Threadling nade a bit more. I don't have a nade charge now, obviously, but that's what it does. Nice. A really good angle there. Very nice. Got one. Get out. Get your help. Put this guy low. Nice. See how delayed this damage is though? Wait, the range on this thing is nice. Everyone is so laggy, bro. Nice. Oh, wait a minute. The tracking is crazy. I thought this thing sucked because I was trying to use it like a barrage. In two kills there is actually pretty impressive. Okay, we end up mercying them. So we will definitely play a third game for this video. But dude, this pulse is correct. Hopefully we can get like a better hit reg game as well. Because that felt so laggy. Of 17. Okay, we got Vostok. I hate the map. But for a pulse rifle, it could work. Part of me wants to just send it on Top Tree Dawn for the last game. So I can float, but... Mm, yeah, let's try it. Screw it. A little different. We did two games on strand. Bring some variety into it. We'll be Icarus Dash and we'll be floating. What the hell, bro? Is invisible. Okay. Redlings. Holy shit. Okay. Yep. He pulled his ghost out. Nice kill. That rift down challenge this guy. So we go. What are you doing? Cobra Kai. He's a primary, sir. Damn. Wait, why did he just, like, forget about me? Dude. Pulse just zaps people. No, oh, I heard his stupid little hunter footsteps creeping up on me. Ooh, good team shot. What if I would have two bursts in without my teammate hitting him there? Bro, this guy's still invisible. What? What the fuck? One of my teammates is invisible too. Maybe we have five attack here. We did. All right, some chase. Interesting. Situation got pretty scary, so we went for the well. With tunnel vision. I'm really impressed by this thing. How, how, how like nice it is to use a pulse rifle sometimes, bro. Well, we mercyed again.
Hi. I didn't want to shoot, I just want to kill myself. We ended up mercying, I don't know what, 21 and 4. Not a bad game by any means. Okay, so that is going to be it for today's video on the Neo Muna Pulse Rifle. Obviously, you can craft all these Neo Muna weapons, so I'm really excited to try out an enhanced Headseeker roll. I'm not sure what we can get in the first column that will be the Garb roll. Okay, so I think we probably did get the best roll. I think Tunnel Vision would be the go-to. I didn't really realize. Maybe Tunnel Vision Kill Clip instead of Tunnel Vision Headseeker, but... Either way, this thing can roll some nice things. You could probably do some cool stuff with Elemental Capacitor on Void for the stability as well. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I am trying to pump out the content now that Lightfall is out. So if you enjoyed, please be sure to drop a like and a sub and catch my next Lightfall video in your sub box. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.